Here's another good example of whales outsmarting people in the Mediterranean. On the receiving end is another prized fishing industry. Not herring this time, but giant bluefin tuna. A fish as big as this will net the crew at least $2,000. The boats are following a long tradition. Every summer after spawning, bluefin tuna migrate from the Mediterranean to the Atlantic Ocean. Each year, the fishermen are waiting. And so are the killer whales. Concrete blocks take the bait down to 200 meters because tuna swim very deep as well as fast. With the line paid out, the crew can only wait and hope and watch the whales. A fish has been hooked. The sound of the winch is a signal to the waiting whales. The fishermen will have to work as fast as possible to bring in the line. The whales simply bide their time. By the time the fish nears the boat, all the fight has gone out of it. This is as easy a meal as a killer whale could hope for. strip the tuna in minutes. All that remains for the fishermen are leftovers. This piracy on the high seas doesn't do much for the whale's popularity, but this is just too good an opportunity for them to miss. These killer whales began stealing fish in this way around 30 years ago. Now, the culture has spread among all the members of two local pods. The fishing boats don't stand a chance. <laughs> <laughs> 